it's probably been a month since I had all of this day out essence and I want to train my rune crafting a little bit because it's still my lowest skill. We got a bunch of staminas but I want to try out a method that I saw on reddit which was a week ago and hopefully it wasn't patched like i don't know if there's i don't know if it's rune light or is it because of the steam client jagex made it so you can see a little bit further away than you would normally do so as far as i know wait hold up i have to go to zmi world because otherwise these guys are gonna be keep damaging me do you remember back in the oas buddy days you could just click on the altar from the bank and you wouldn't need to you know how people you know how sometimes people are lazy, they just follow each other and some people... Wait, maybe I'm gonna see this guy do this. This guy's kind of AFK. I just want to show this in action. Basically, in, oh, there was a guy. I don't know if you saw it. There's a lot of people using other people as taxis because that's uh, an AFK way to get to ZMI Alta. You just follow somebody. But of course, that guy could go AFK. That's just something that people do. Now, if you remember back in the OS Buddy days, like five years ago or something, you could one-click Alter from the bank all the way just like that and you know what i just tested it oh there we go that's the altar wait this okay so you have to right click i guess wait can i okay you can click basically from all the way wait is it actually gonna work why why are people actually following each other so from the bank i could just click like this and just walk all the way to the altar this makes it extremely afk and again this was patched at some point uh i think it was either by os buddy because jagex complained about this to them or maybe just Jags fix it altogether. I'm I'm not sure about that, but it's available again. I think it's because of the Steam client where they made it just, just so you can see a little bit bigger on the default client. So it's not even Runelite, I don't believe, and it works. I didn't even click anything. Dude, this makes it so much more AFK. Like this little rune crafting can actually be enjoyable to train. I, I can't believe this. So currently, I am level 63, and I want to see how far I can get with 13,000 dealt essence that I have banked. Close the bank. Actually, you could just mark the object so it's easier to see and boom that's it lean back baby and just room craft that's that's the way you room craft hey, i gotta say hey three levels not that bad huh level 66 i still got like 7k essence left it just uh i, I don't really feel like room crafting i want a pvm a little bit now i didn't show you this in my last video but i gave away bottomless bucket to doug because i wasn't just doing that much farming he was doing it way more i'm only level 75 i'm gonna increase it a little bit now but if i don't get a bucket from this one which probably i won't that means i'll have to do yeah, no. It is time to mine some volcanic ash. But when we did a lot of worldy content, I collected 600 super compost and my teammates laughed like it's not a good drop. It, I don't have to like rot the vegetables anymore in this 600 times, baby. Uh, what a beautiful morning. Got my coffee and we're playing RuneScape once again. So first of all, we're going to do a couple things that I need to finish right now. I got 1,200 volcanic ash, made all of them into ultra compost. Wait, can I get a farming level? 105k XP to go. It's actually important level because I am 1825 total now and I can grow animal plants finally without any boost. So I may check that out. I somehow had all of these battle staffs in the bank. So it is time to make some orbs, attach them, alk them, because I need GP. 700k only left. Now usually I don't buy daily battle stats, but this time I thought I'm gonna make an exception. It's not that much GP. I think you profit like 120k, so still decided to do it. 222 in total, bunch of rune items. Let me alk all of it. So that's 3 million cash. There's also 300k in the bank. However, I also got all this leather. So let me convert this and then alk it again for more cash. For the very first time, I want to try out the 10 leather. It just... Oh, just... Oh, it is 5. Okay, so it's not the whole inventory as I thought. Uh, is it... Yeah, is, is it even worth it? Shouldn't you just go to like... It's okay, I guess. I mean, not as fast as I thought, but I guess it's like uh, making flex. I think that's how you do it. You convert the spear like this. 300,000 coins, which I thought it was half a million, but apparently it's a little bit cheaper. Now we've got one-handed instead of two-handed, which means I can equip a dragon fire shield or anti-dragon, just a regular one. We don't have a visage. If I erupt the dickside teleport, I only got two options, but I do believe if I use it on this place... No. Oh yeah, you can see the necklace right there. So I can just use it like this. It binds to this place and now there's another teleport. But I'm wondering where exactly does it teleport you to? Like how close to Rune Dragons is it? Oh, you still have to walk all the way through the doors and enter it. Hmm. 
Okay, let me try the method that I was gonna use because I don't want to use too many prayer potions and I would just be happy if I could do one kill, teleport out, recharge everything, teleport back, kill one, maybe two. I don't even know how difficult they are. Okay, so they hit quite a lot. I'll have to do like walk step like this. So they never hit me with melee. I assume that would be better than uh, the usual method. Dude, they have so much HP, 330. Why would it? Okay, so gorillas have similar amount. Obviously, gorillas are like slightly harder to kill. Potentially, I mean, you still have to swap weapons. It just, uh, I feel like the speed could be very similar on task, especially. Uh, but the drop rate of Z knights is like three times more common. So why would you grind for dragon limbs? Look what we have in the storage. As I wake up today, three odium shards. Apparently, they spent one hour and twenty minutes at Scorpia. Got three odium shards. And it's finished. The statistics eventually did even out. We didn't have to spend like eight hours at Crazy Archaeologist for only two Odium shards like last time. So now we're missing three shards from the Chaos Fanatic. No, oh, missed it. No, 77 farm big has been achieved, dude. It's, it's like uh, every day I do one farm run with the trees. I got 16,000 XP until my next construction level, and I also got these long bones. So why not give them in? Yes, please. And that's going to be 36,000 experience and a level. Thank you very much. Also, I was giving these bones to get to 74 prayer because most of the team has it already. So it's my turn now. So if anyone gets any bones, we just they just deposit into the storage. I don't know. It's probably not going to be a couple levels, but it could be because it's only 22 until level 70. Let's see if I can get to 72 prayer. Wait, does that count as a death? Because that was 31. I want to see actually. Because I, I don't know if it's PVM deaths or not. Oh wait, it actually doesn't count as a death if you die from PVM death. Okay. Well, I guess I died 31 times from actual players then in, in, in Wildy over the time. Now, see, Dragon Bones give 252 experience per bone, but these will give 175. So, probably will not get a couple levels, but, you know. Oh, that's a prayer level, 71, there we go. Dude, my total level is just increasing, like, heavily, by me barely doing anything. It just, whenever you, like, stop actually leveling actively your total level, Eventually, after like a week or a couple of weeks, like most of your skills are so close to leveling up, like even Slayer, 20k XP, then you got Mining, 33, just by doing random stuff that you don't even think about. It just like Thieving is 144k XP, Herblord, 20k XP, you know, that kind of stuff. It just, oh, I love it. This is the time where you just like level them all up. Can I have another Bone Crusher, please? I'm going to say, yeah, it has no charges. I need active tokens in this place. Okay, I've seen some people claiming, I think, free... Like, I, this is something I've never really done. The free bones that you can claim, I think, from this guy. Okay, wait, so no pots, I assume, then. Claim again. Okay, okay. Oh, now I can instantly... Oh. 13 out of 26 bucket of slime bone meal today. Now, of course, this is less XP. You get only 200, but you, like, save the bones in the world. So it's actually, like, way more in the wilderness if you do it, but... If you need actor tokens, 65 actor tokens, how much is this gonna give even? A thousand? Dude, that's a lot. So that means I can crush a thousand six hundred bones, I assume, by just doing Slayer and random stuff. And let's do it one more time for another 65, 3,200 charges so far. So I can do this daily, yeah. And that is 71 Herblor. At the moment, I got a greater demon task and also two dark totems. So let's see what I can get. Also, only 6,000 charges left of my Arc Light. So it would be nice to replenish a little bit from Scotizo itself. It is skill count number six. I'm just going to look at the collection log. Anything, anything. Do, 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 do. And nothing, but there's Onyx Voltefs and Ancient Shard and a clue. Oh, for God, I should probably do a clue scroll now and then come back. Right, what is inside this casket? And that is Sara Chaps. God damn it, it's always the Chaps. Like, there's no bodies. We have too many. There's no, no need for this. It's just for Fashionscape at this point. And Armadale page 2. Come on, baby. Pop that collection log right now. Bam. Well, three room play buddies. And one ancient shard only. But a hard clue once again. And this is the second clue from Scotizo. Boho. What year is this? 2005? Could have sold, sold them for quite a bit of profit. Okay, Zami play likes 46k. 55k for Santa play likes. There we go. Wait, Nick added, I think, a thousand emeralds. Okay, I'm gonna take this because this is for dual... I guess dual rings? I mean, where else would you use it? Like, 
no one stuns core, I believe at least, with, with like Emerald Bolts, even if they do, you don't need that many, but dual innings you may run out, but some people are using house, like the jewelry box, but I hate that, because it's much easier to just use a dual ring to teleport, because when you teleport to the house, you have like the loading screen that you have to go through, I just don't like it, I never liked it, on my main I don't use it, even though I have the jewelry box, I'm gonna grab these for now, and just gonna keep them for, I'm not gonna make there's too many. I can't, man. I think I'm the only one with a diary, so I'm gonna crush a thousand nests. Made some toad flax and finished potions as well. To the brew's gonna be coming in for that PVMing. Right, another casket from doing Slayer. I already have the full Gothics book, so I don't need it, but my teammates may need this. Wait, how much money did I lose on this? I made a small mistake. I wanted to buy some rune arrows because I don't know where the blowpipe is. I want to just do the demonic gorillas off task. And I was like, I'm just going to buy 50 by 50. You know, I just shift click on these because uh, they were 520 GP each. How the hell are rune arrows 2,500 each at this? Like, what? Dude, dude, you just buy 10 and it's 25k gone by just buying 10 stupid rune arrows. Yes, I know I can do LMS for this, but like it's if you have like 1 million cash, I expected maybe to spend 150k, maybe 200k on like 1,000 1, arrows. This is, no, this is not supposed to be like this. Oh god, I got scammed. Oh my god, I lost like 300k for like this amount of arrows, not even that. Yeah, <laughs> what the hell, bro? <laughs> Still trying to get that demonic gorilla task. Uh, get the shield of half instead, huh? Wait, what? What the hell? Why is that a kite shield in a blue color? What the hell is going on? G average 26k. What? Who did that, huh? Who manipulated the prices? This is the... <laughs> No, it's not 26k. This is just so weird. I see the green text on the floor. It's just four Addy Kite Shields. Who made this price go up? I, I thought it would be like a little bit more traded. You can manipulate as easily. Because it's also like a free-to-play item. But you can. I don't want to I don't want to see this green test go away. So got a spiritual creatures task and today we had an update which made so that the creatures at next room can drop dragon boots as well because previously they were just not in the drop table. So I'm going to try to go and kill them because I do have a feeling that they are completely free a prayer. What I mean by that is that they just drop super restores and if you need to replenish you just drink them and you have infinite prayer as Far as I could tell, at least on my testing, on the very first day when Next was released. Now, before I do that, I wanted to show you that a lot of clan names have been changed because they were like offensive. Because a lot of them would actually, it would, they were really funny, but uh, I could see why they were changed. But I couldn't find our name, huh? Wait, the, our name was changed too. It was just Cool Cats. The reason why I'm saying this is because when I went through the link that I usually go through, it says you cannot find the group. So did they mess it? Wait, what the hell? They messed it up. I don't know which one we are right now. We were all the way to rank 18, I believe. Very close, something like that. But our group name is not set. I guess I'm the leader and I have to set it back. Wait, there's way more. Initially, it wasn't that many names. Did they re Oh, God. That's, that's a lot of... Uh-huh. Okay. Uh, let me go back, I guess, to the game. Wait, it says group name, Cool Cats. Well, what the hell is... No, it says right here. Group name Cool Cats. I'll try like this too. Accept the name. Did someone change to this? It's not available. Wait, someone did actually name the client like this. Okay, Cool Cats 22 maybe. Accept it. Oh no, I cannot change it. Seven days before you can rename the group. No! Someone's gonna snipe the name. It's gone. Jagex, you made this happen. Wait, either we rank 20... Wait, it's not even set. Do I have to log off? I can't see. Okay, I'm going to log off right now. I just did. Okay, let's go. It, it's just, it's not set. It it doesn't work. I changed the name. I wasted, oh no. Well, I guess there's a way if you click on rank 20, maybe that's us. Nope, that's not us. Rank 19, are we that high? Yes, we're at rank 19. Okay, excellent. It just says group name is not set, I guess. Um, But we are at rank 19. Very close to, you could say, rank 17 we could go. I know you can. Oh, okay. Yeah, there we go. Uh, yeah, you yeah, fairly close. Fairly close. Maybe that's why I should be training Slayer. Look at this. Where's my Black Demon task, man? I'm like 50k away from 84 now. It's like a Slayer level and a half without a Black Demon task. Look, I tried to do it off task, but it's just not good. If, if you do it on task, you get like free. Was it like 60k, 70k, 90k Slayer XP? 
by just simply killing the mono gorillas. Not to mention, of course, you get accuracy and damage boost. So usually I would kill these mages with range, but I'm very sure melee is not going to be a problem. The only issue that uh, wait, they probably have more HP than the regular spiritual mages, so but it, it did seem like three zeros in a row, or oh, four zeros in a row. Are you joking? Well, it can't be that bad. Like the hits, it was forty and thirty-seven, but then zero, 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 and then was gonna. Oh, dude, it's not good. It's oh my god, I don't have a teleport from this place. Also, I I, I didn't take it. I need to. Oh god, no, it's bad. Okay, gonna have to bring range i guess they just have too high defense for this oh no it's really bad like i'm actually it's gonna take me like 10 minutes to get the kill count which is only like a few mages to kill <laughs> how the hell do they have like no robes it's like ceremonial you should be like slicing through it what's with the zeros wait maybe my stats are decreased wait they oh i think the mage cast you see strength is not decreased so cl clearly i potted it's the attack level unless i keep repotting every time but all right this should be easy Look at the accuracy. Yes. Eh, oh god. Every oh, what is just melting before my eyes compared to me? Like Jesus, they're not gonna be respawning in time. Also, respawn timers are not bad for these guys. It's only thirteen seconds or so, so you can just camp two of them at the same time. Uh, by the time I kill this, there's gonna be spawn already. Oh, wait, it was a new item. Oh yeah, yeah. Because on this account, I never killed next, so that makes sense. And the whole shard. I didn't know they actually drop them, but. There we go. I think it's used to make these uh, ancient brews, uh, which give you prayer, but it's only good for mage. If you're using it for melee, then your stats will be drained dramatically. So it's literally just for mage, maybe for Zalar or something. So I still got 49 to kill. Uh, okay, so just decrease 40, but this is just massive kill count at the moment. Not like it matters anyway, but this is how the inventory looks like at the moment. A lot of these ancient brews. I don't want to wait let me drink this wait it doesn't decrease range i thought i thought it did but it gives you prayer should i use this i mean probably not uh, uh no no no. they still give us plus six magic bonus which i'm very sure the team could benefit from so i'm just gonna bank all of these and even though you get super restores they're just not enough to sustain yourself unless you include also runners and snapdragons that you get then yes but you just cannot camp the whole task in there Bro, I was like, what the hell is this? It was even broadcasted in the chat. <laughs> okay, thank you very much for this. I could maybe check it in. I mean, it gives prayer bonus, which is, I think it's equal. Oh, it actually gives attack bonus as well. So it's monk robes, but also gives you magic attack bonus. How do they look? I see. Well, I'm going to keep them. <laughs> Dude, that's a new lock as well. <laughs> that's so quick, dude. dude this is me receiving ceremonial legs. I think the next kill I received dragon boots. I was so heavily AFKing this place. I was like, what's ancient ceremonial? That has to be me. It's blue as cat. What is he killing these as well? Was it a slayer task or what? Malediction, the redemption, and coming. That is true. All of the pieces that we got so far were different. So maybe, but it's like. Such a thing that we don't really need these. It's just nice to have. So I, I wouldn't want a redemption on these things, but maybe on the God Wars bosses. Like Bandos. Why the hell do we have five Bandos boots and three hilts and nothing else? Two, another dragon boots. Oh, baby. Two boots and one task. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh, blood essence. Dude, <laughs> that's another thing that's... Jesus, bro, what is this task? I, I love it. So it used to be 2 million, right? This is something that he wanted to get on an Iron Man early. So the actual price in the Grand Exchange was around 400k. I know because I tested this out on my main account, but I don't think I ever included it in my videos. You could buy this for 400k. The game thought that it was approximately 2 million. So in the death coffer, you could add this one. It would be worth 2 million, but you only spend 400k. So you could really just buy like 10 of them Add in 20 million in your death coffer, but you only spend 5 million. It was a very nice item. 
it's been fixed since then, I believe. It is used for blood rune crafting, and I think none of us can do it at the moment. All right, so that was my last skill. I just completed the task. If you look at the XP in here, I was gaining approximately 80,000 ranging XP an hour with adamant darts with a blowpipe at level 88 range, which is very close to level 89. But also Slayer XP, 20k is really not bad without cannon or without uh, bursting or anything like that. Just simply training Slayer. But the whole task did take me slightly a little bit over one hour to do. So even though I was killing them fast, but it still took me one hour. So the next time I'm going to get these mages, I actually love them because they were very generous to me. But let's go ahead now, get another task. Try to get those black demons, man. I want to get some Xenites already. Come on. Also, if you're wondering what the loot looks like, it's right there on the screen. 15 super stores. Again, it just wasn't enough to sustain because you're using range. So you don't have like proselyte armor. Nothing really that gives you prayer. So yes, you do get a little bit less, like I said. But loot wise, yeah. It's, it, it's okay. I wish I picked up the astral runes because I got 1,200 and I didn't pick up barely any so let's get another task and that's gonna be vampires but probably vampires can drop a clue scroll i'm not sure so i'm gonna go ahead and complete this one so i can get another one later on no oh, look ceremonial top again oh <laughs> that's over the bank Ooh, second one baby okay this is um i don't know where i got this hard clue from but let's open this one bam dude yes sorry oh dude a master clue as well this very good dude Nice boots, man. Very nice boots. One million worth as well. That's why I don't want to keep any hard clues in my bag. I want to complete them. And maybe not like... Because because there was one time when I went to Greater Demon Task. Like, I killed two Greater Demons and I got a clue. Probably I don't want to leave at that point. But every time you complete a task, and if you get a clue, just do it. Because it could be worth it. Now, what about this Master Clue, huh? What is this? Sherlock. Okay, immediately. I think at this point, we only need one Boots and then all of us have it. Maybe two, but I do believe it's one. Or maybe we have it completed already. I can't tell. We have at least three Boots is what I'm saying. You see, even Nick says four out of five. I think, yeah, it's so, something like that. Like one or couple boots missing dude i think that's a good deal i'll trade you ancient dragon high top for Saturday dragon high boots okay but that has to be like almost permanent uh i believe he is going to be using crystal armor because he's doing a lot of gauntlets i'm gonna deposit this so he needs boots but he doesn't need that top because he can make it or he probably made it already all right candor and teleport come on sherlock i don't even care dude just fail me on the first step so i don't have to waste my time jesus Dude, Nick has done 395 Corrupting Omelette. I feel so bad for him. Because he's spending all the time in there. He could have uh, spent all the time like gaining total levels and stuff. Or doing Fletch Erundart. What is that? 81 Fletching. Dude, oh no, I have to boost. At this point, I still don't know where I got these Rune Dart ups. I know Dark was asking me for one at a time. So I'm assuming he was also doing Master Clues. I just got them from somewhere. Probably maybe those... Uh, chest that you unlock maybe Laurent's keys or brimstone keys which i've never done so has to be Laurent's or I, I i have no idea i don't know where i got them from oh my god first oh dude oh plus five immediately yo what a stupid thing that it can teleport only once dude they, they it's so bad like the, the rewards that they made like ardon cloak has like five teleports i believe on hard diaries this only has one. The Western, I think it's only one as well. Yep, I cannot use it because I also use it for a clue scroll. This is one. This is one. That it, I know I said this before, but it's just so weird and stupid. Okay, have this. This one is going to be Bordrat Luminata. Easy. And I got my ancient dragon hide body. That is going to be mine. For now, at least. Okay, another one. Follow the bard. Oh, here we go, dude. It's always these. It comes from the ground underneath. So, oh, I need basalt. Okay, that's easy. I can just teleport to that place and mine it now. Trees and Moroccan items. Okay, I can easily get that. Bibli Arceus, easy. Speak to the Trogil and Death Altar, easy, because I've done the quest. Okay, this is completable as well. What is the next one? Oh, God, another one. Lovada, easy. Deep Wilderness Dungeon, easy. Speak to Mage in Rune Shop. That did this is exactly the same. I still have the Zami items on me. Zami Koif and... Okay, well... Uh, okay, that's doable. Nice. Come on, baby. What is it gonna be? Woodcutting Guild? Jeez. Okay. Okay, this one is easy because it could be anywhere on the map. But because I completed every single quest in the game, I have a quest cape... It doesn't matter what it is for me. 
I will be able to complete this one. Three potential steps in the wilderness. There's no way it's gonna be wildy though, yeah? If I teleport to Camelot and I scan this again, it's gonna say outside the crafting guild with a cow potentially. Wait, that is oh my god. <laughs> oh no, I didn't bring any weapons. <laughs> what the dude, I was so lucky. <laughs> okay, this could be the last step. Come on, baby. Look, you don't have to tease me anymore. Just take this. Yes, thank you. Okay, I'm gonna type in pause champ and gonna open this master kill scroll. God damn, it's always so stupid. Got new item, Morton Teleport. Get the hell away from me, man. I actually did four master kills. That's a lot for an account like this. And it's been so long since I even tried to do it. Let's go and kill those vampires. Maybe a blood shard will pop out. Sarakness? I don't know how easy it is to kill it at this level. I'm gonna go for 35. I don't know, maybe for a red spider eggs. I did not get a blood shard from vampires, but I did get this instead. What the hell is this? Okay. It's actually the perfect topic. If I go to my group storage, there's five egg sacks. This is what I get from Sarakness, and apparently you can just... Wait, what if you do it like this? Okay, it's only deposit. What if you go back to the bank? Apparently you can just empty... Oh, just... You don't have to cut it and bank each eggs all the time. You can just do like, yeah, five. Actually, I need these because I got all of these Haralanders. Oh, there we go. First egg sack obtained from this boss, 22 to go. Come on, baby. That is the casket. All right, let's open this. And, well, actually, a whole ablation. That's actually massive. That is my very first one, yes. I know we have a... Uh, one maybe in in the whole team but that was my very first one Wait, what the hell is going on go to draw but accept the chat thing but don't accept the second someone's getting scammed sweet guess kamazd oh my god what <laughs> it sounds so scripted what what's it running to what the hell happened <laughs> okay well anyway i'll i'll see you soon um yeah that was weird bye bye